Outfittersrating.com. Enter. You've entered Outfittersrating.com. Program engaged. Welcome, Bill. Welcome, Doug. Select this week's adventure. Select species, white-tailed deer. Select location, Saskatchewan. Select outfitter, Safari River Outdoors. Outfittersrating.com TV starts now. Outfitters Rating TV's Doug Hamrick is in Saskatchewan with high hopes of taking a giant Canadian white-tailed buck. Doug is hunting with Troy Mercier and Safari River Outdoors. Troy's been doing this a long time and Safari River's reputation has been built on a quality first approach. That is evident in the accommodations, the quality of the gear, and the approach and effort put into maintaining the hunting sites and especially the overall health of the deer herd. In fact, Troy only utilizes a little more than half the number of deer tags allocated to his territory. Allowing superior bucks to mature to full potential is a top priority. If you're an experienced trophy whitetail hunter, the routine Doug rolls into should sound very familiar. Get up early, really early. Start with a healthy dose of coffee and a hearty breakfast. Make sure all the necessities for a long day in the field are ready to go. Gear up and head out. Troy takes Doug on a freezing ride to his blind. Even in the daylight shortened days of late autumn, it's going to be a long, cold sit. But Doug is fortunate. The activity near his blind starts early and lasts pretty much all day long. While no big bucks are coming in, the antlers on the young deer offer proof of the combined genetic potential and quality management practices Safari River employs. That's a beauty of hunting up here. I love it. I've been coming up here. You and I have been hunting together, what, 10, 10 years yeah. or so? You never know what's going to come out, mm -hmm. especially here in Saskatchewan. It's so thick. Uh, what's north of us? Bush, Bush for hundreds of miles. Yep. There's nothing. So they, and we're kind of on that farmland bush line. Right, basically. we're right on the fringe, yeah. So they got the feed and they got the cover. So literally at any time, anything could walk out. As we check our cameras right now, since there's snow, mm -hmm. um, we're getting new bucks every time we check them. We do have just under 200,000 acres to hunt. So that's a lot of area to cover. There's a lot of area for the deer to move around in, but. Well, and explain that 200,000 acres, is that designated? Is that your zone? Our, Ours is an outfitter, that's only our area. So you have that, no other outfitters are in that area, so that's your, how about local pressure? Very little, uh, they stay close to the main highways, they don't go in deep like we do. Okay, so you typically are not getting other pressure, it's just what you guys are doing. That's right. So we shouldn't see anybody, hear anybody, smell anybody this that's week, right. everything's good. Mm -hmm.
Doug hasn't seen the big guy yet, but he's seen a lot of bucks that, give it a few years, may very well become the big guy. The first day passed quickly, and the promise of what the next day might bring has Doug looking forward to the early morning wake-up call that's to come. Outfitters Rating TV returns in a moment. Outfitters Rating TV is brought to you by OutfittersRating.com. Trust, but verify. EuroOptic.com, the source for premium firearms and optics. Swacker, broadheads that open so fast you can hear the swack. Kamir Deer, the revolutionary deer attractant. And by Leica. Doug Hamrick for OutfittersRating.com. Folks, you cannot believe the number of emails and phone calls we receive from people on bad trips. Some literally to the point of tears because they've saved for years. Others not happy because they're not getting those services as contracted. OutfittersRating.com can eliminate those risks and help you book with confidence. Actually, we're getting a lot of emails and phone calls thanking us for the service. It's working, folks. OutfittersRating.com. Outfitters Rating TV's Doug Hamrick has spent a lifetime pursuing big game. In recent years, his pursuits have taken him to Africa, New Zealand, Argentina, and all across North America in search of all manner of big game. But no matter where his travels take him, Doug's passion for hunting whitetail has never diminished. There will always be a whitetail hunt or two on his schedule every year. While it takes several things coming together perfectly to take a trophy whitetail buck, there are two ever-present elements. Obviously, you have to be in big whitetail country, and you must have patience. Doug has spent a lot of time in the woods through the years in pursuit of whitetail, and he's taken some good bucks. He's also experienced his fair share of the slow days as well. Those days you're happy just to see two squirrels chase each other. The days you've looked at your watch half a dozen times in a half hour stretch, and you've eaten your lunch by 10. Yes, patience. That ability to stick it out just a little longer is often what separates success from failure. Doug's had those days, and he was mentally prepared for that coming into this hunt. Long, cold sits, little action, a test of patience. But he's pleasantly surprised. His first day out was action-packed. Doug saw a lot of deer, a lot of bucks, young bucks, but deer that clearly show the trophy potential of the area outfitted by Troy Mercier and Safari River Outdoors. Doug will still have to be patient, but it's easier when you're seeing a lot of deer. Something that impressed me, you said you had a number of tags, mm -hmm. but you're literally only taking about half the hunters for the number of tags you have for the deer. That's right, we have 52 permits and we'll max out at 35. That's why do you do that? We're after a trophy um, ranch mm -hmm. type of thing and you can't do it with them kind of numbers. Yeah, so. you don't hear that very often. Folks, most people will stack <laughs> up for the amount of tags they have, they're gonna load up for hunters, because that's money or mm -hmm. that's a loss. If you have those tags and you're not bringing hunters in, that's a direct loss to your bottom line. Right. So you guys have looked at it long-term, you're, long you're managing for a trophy quality mm -hmm. and you've literally cut that in half. Right. Because you could easily double up what, what you have here. Oh, without a doubt, yeah. yeah. But it would change. Yes, it change everything. Like many Saskatchewan whitetail pursuits, this is a baited hunt. While the obvious overall reason is to bring the deer into a single spot for the hunter, it does serve other purposes. The object of every hunter should be a good, clean shot. In this heavily timbered country, getting an unobstructed shot can be a challenge. Doug's blind is positioned on the edge of a cleared out area with a clear lane to where the deer are feeding. If the right buck comes in, Doug should get a solid shot opportunity. Feeding also helps keep the deer in the area 
allowing the outfitter using trail cameras to keep tabs on what bucks are around and to some extent helps serve as a nutritional supplement in this harsh unforgiving country thick woods that it's tangled we had a nasty blow down here last june and it's it's thick you can't see into it other than these natural little draws and stuff you can't walk through in Hardly. some cases. Yeah. It's tough. I mean, it's burr rabbit thick. Right. So you're baiting or using bait stations to draw the deer out. Right. And and typically you have to do that. Otherwise, you're not seeing these, these bucks, especially the bigger bucks in the daylight hours. Right. Yeah. They're, it's such thick timber that they, they virtually, they can hide for their whole life. The mounts on the wall and the photos on the website do a good job of telling the Safari River Outdoors story. The recent images captured by trail cam have a more profound effect on Doug. Lots of deer, lots of action. Doug's hunt continues in a moment. Hey folks, what's your dream hunt? Big whitetails in the North Country? Maybe kudu on the Kalahari, a red stag in New Zealand. Whatever you're looking for anywhere in the world, we have it. Come to the site, outfittersrating.com. You can look them up by species, location, or outfitter. Look them up, know what you're going to get before you go, then travel the world with confidence. Outfittersrating.com. Outfittersrating.com will change the way you look at outfitters and charters. Outfitters, if you do what you say you do and run a quality business, it's a no-brainer. It's free, it's quick, and it's simple. Hunters and fishermen, now you have the resources to verify you get what you pay for. All you have to do is visit the outfitter testimonials on the site and you'll understand why you want to be here. Outfittersrating.com. Trust, but verify. At EuroOptic.com, we provide only the finest optics and shooting products available, including night vision and thermal vision monoculars, goggles, and weapon sights from brands you trust, like Benelli, EOTech, Saco, and Night Force. So the next time you're looking for quality optics or firearms, call us at 570-220-3159 or visit us at EuroOptic.com. You want to supercharge your corn, grain, or protein pellet? Try new Camir Deer Corn Coat. Whatever you treat, the deer will eat. And Corn Coat is so simple to mix, you just pour it in and shake it up. We have had some absolutely amazing results by using Camir Deer Corn Coat. You've got to try it. Camir Deer. Every big game hunter dreams of pursuing giant white-tailed bucks. While some are fortunate to have access to well-managed land with great hunting, for most, a trophy pursuit means an outfitted hunt. To find the right outfitter, the internet is a fantastic tool. Just type in whitetail outfitters and perfect. Just under two million sites to sift through. Well, Perhaps narrowing the search down a bit will help, say with Saskatchewan Whitetail Outfitters. And there you have it, just a couple of months research and a nasty case of carpal tunnel syndrome and you'll be ready for your dream hunt. If you can still hold your gun, there is a better way. Outfittersrating.com is a great tool to narrow the search regardless of desired species or location. But that's not the best part. The system is unbiased. The ratings are completely derived from surveys filled out by past clients, good, bad, or otherwise. Doug Hamrick is hunting with Safari River Outdoors. Like all trips featured on Outfitters Rating TV, the planning started at the website. The ratings on the site aren't based on having the biggest or fanciest. They're based on outfitters delivering what they promised. It doesn't take long for Doug to discover Troy Mercier and his staff do just that. What's for dinner tonight, by the way? Lasagna. No, 
Yes. No kidding, that's my favorite. <laughs> it's the fat free lasagna though? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> well then it's really my favorite. Comfortable, clean accommodations. Three square meals a day. The proper equipment to safely execute the hunt. And best of all, there are a lot of deer here. Time can really drag sitting in a blind all day long. Fortunately for Doug, there's been a constant coming and going of deer to entertain. This place is covered up in deer this morning. The rut is starting to pick up. Some of the young bucks are testing each other, but nothing too serious yet. They're getting ready. We're just on that front edge of the rut. Lots of blood here, right there. It's about 20 yards. Wow! Look at those beams. Look at that. seeing Saskatchewan right there. Recently, a series of grueling tests were conducted to show the performance of today's top broadheads. Test one, durability. Swacker shows its toughness. Test two, penetration. Crushes this shoulder blade, cutting 18 inches deep. Test three, extreme angles. Swacker dominates the quartering shot. See how the Swacker performed in all the tests at Swacker.com.
In my business, you're only as good as your gear, and nothing I carry gets more use than my optics. From my binoculars to my rangefinder and spotting scope, I trust one brand. I'm Ivan Carter, and that brand is Leica. Eurooptic.com specializes in premium European optics and firearms. Visit Eurooptic.com for the complete lineup of Leica products. Outfitters Rating TV is brought to you by OutfittersRating.com. Trust, but verify. Eurooptic.com, the source for premium firearms and optics. Swacker, broadheads that open so fast you can hear the swack. Kamir Deer, the revolutionary deer attractant. And by Leica. Safari River Outdoors has provided Doug Hamrick a memorable hunt. There are a lot of deer here, and on just the second day of the hunt, Doug's taken a big Saskatchewan white-tailed buck. Wow, folks. It's always a treat when you get up to them and they're actually bigger on the ground than they were when you were shooting at them or seeing them in the field. That is a beautiful buck. He's wide. He's got long beams, decent length to him. That's what we come to Saskatchewan for. Got him. Beautiful view. He wasn't quite the dink you said he would be. Congratulations. <laughs> oh, wow. He's actually better than I thought he was. This is definitely the, the age class of deer that we want to take. And older if we can too. You got a lot of young bucks, good young bucks. But this is what you're looking for, right? This is exactly what we're looking for. Uh, age, where would he be, range? Five? Yeah, five and a half, I would say, yeah. yeah. Yeah, good solid deer, big bodies. All these deer are big bodied up here though. I guess they have to be to survive the winters. They're very fat yeah. this year. We had an incredible winter last winter, so they should be in great shape. You were due one though. You had two before that that were rough. Yes, very rough. A lot of kill, a lot of loss. The beam width on this thing, it's long. I mean, he's going, he's going. It's like he didn't know where to go. He's branching and kicking. And just outstanding, just a beautiful deer. Now is this characteristic of a lot of the bucks that you get here? Yeah, we get quite a few. The We don't get the width normally, mm -hmm. but the beam length and the weight, the mass is what everybody's after. That big mass. Yeah. I'll tell you what, we didn't count, but I cannot tell you the number of deer we saw yesterday and today and here and this morning. Just covered up in it. Nice, nice deer. What a fabulous setup. Uh, again, we talked about the blind earlier. You guys, uh, you knew where they were. You knew what was happening when even you figured he would come in midday. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and it worked out. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Nice shot. Literally, we saw, uh, I don't, I, I, we didn't count the number of bucks. We seen dozens of good bucks. And a lot, boy, you got a lot of young stock too. Next year, following year, gonna be, uh, if you keep all those, good grief, you're gonna have a lot of big deer. I hope it's gonna pan out for us. Yeah, I mean, you got a lot of good deer now. Mm -hmm. But uh, if you have another good winter, like you were talking about earlier in the week, you know, it's always been a pleasure hunting with you. I'm looking forward to coming it's, back. It's always you. fun. Good job. Picking you up. Love it. I'm looking forward to bear season. We got to get uh, get together on the bear season. The fishing that you guys have here as well, and uh, the deer literally won't leave us alone. <laughs> hey, folks! Make sure to visit the site, sign up for our team membership, and then check out our hunt schedule. 2013, we got a lot of good outfitted hunts. Bill Miller and myself, we'd love to have you come along, and an opportunity to be filmed for the show. Check it out. Sign up for the team membership.